are still working without pay. Today, the Chief Petty Officers Association in Grand Haven took donations behind the Coast Guard station in town. 13 on your side, Shanna Grove tells us about the drive and how you can help. There's never been a time in, in the country's history that the Coast Guard didn't get paid. Until now. We're trying to supplement um, their needs by having a food drive today and um, uh, fundraisers in town, Grand Haven and up and down the lakeshore and actually around the country. People here to help. It shows them that they're not alone. When it matters most. The community standing behind them, the community wants to help them. The Coast Guard has around 41,000 active duty members who didn't get paid this week. There's 170 people stationed here. Um, it, it takes a lot of a lot of caring individuals to care for 170 families. The need will continue. The folks are just coming by, dropping off canned goods, frozen turkeys, hams, chicken, bacon. As long as the shutdown does. They're going to have, um, you know, sometime this month, a, a power bill and a gas bill. Payments piling up. A mortgage payment or a rent payment. Um, life insurance, car insurance. But hope is harbored here on Harbor Drive. Everybody likes the festival and the carnival in the summertime, but this is where the rubber meets the road. In Grand Haven, Shanna Grove. It's a tearjerker. 13 on your side.